Fields of green corn and beans have turned to fields of gold now, which means harvest time is here. Yeah, TV6's Kayla Page is here and reports on the ups and downs of fall <laughs> on the farm. Yeah, corn and soybeans, they are truly a global market, and during this time of year, farms are simply trying to break even when it comes to production. As for Rob Ewald, he is pleased that the dry weather has allowed him to achieve a level of corn production that he thought would not be attainable. Quite a bit above average production, so uh, we're thankful for that, seeing as the prices are a little bit low this year. Rob Ewalt started farming full-time in 1996 after attending Iowa State University for ag business. He initially attended college to become a teacher, but soon realized a career in agriculture was his calling. A farm became available to rent near his parents and thus began his full-time farming career, a passion that ignited during fall harvest season. The perfect harvest is probably going on right now. We're seeing tremendous yields um, and, and good weather that it hasn't slowed us up. To be honest with you, uh, um, this is day 18 and, and I could use a rain because we're, I think we're all getting a little bit tired at this point and, and could use a little break. But when you have a nice breeze like we have today, great temperatures, full sunshine, it's tough not to, not to go out and harvest. So right now we're, we're really seeing ideal conditions for bringing this crop in in eastern Iowa. From seed to fertilizer, in his time, he has watched the value of his crop go down year after year, while the yield continues to be above average. His biggest wish as the fall harvest season continues? Higher prices. We'd always wish for higher prices. With whatever business you're in, you always want to try to do the best you can and to provide for your family. So that's what we're trying to do. Nevertheless, he says the weather has been almost perfect and is grateful to be able to make a little change despite a little drought. This time of the year, is, it's a report card. It, it, it lets us know if we've achieved it. And, uh, you know, there's every year we're striving for improvement and, and every year we are seeing improvement in production. Farmer Ewalt wanted to also send out a little reminder to the public that you'll see much more farm equipment out on the roads and in typical seasons. And he says patience is key to avoid any serious accidents. Good reminder. Thank you, Kayla. In addition to that, Iowa's Secretary of Agriculture released a statement. Mike Negg says, although suitable for harvest, these warm and dry conditions paired with low humidity and gusty winds also produce an environment that could lead to field fires. He's encouraging everyone to be prepared, have a plan, and keep safety top of mind as you're in the field, on the road, and around the farm.